Hi guys, in this video I'm going to be sharing with you five different pretty nail designs with flowers for spring. I hope you guys like it, so let's get started. To start off, don't forget to apply your base coat. Always apply a base coat because this is going to help protect the nails from any staining. Then I used a white nail polish and I'm going to be using the sponge technique. So I used a green nail polish color and a minted color, which you can always go back and pause because I listed all the nail polishes that I used in the beginning and I'm also going to be putting them in the description box below. I'm gonna be using a brush, nail brush this time, but you can always use a toothpick, which I have used toothpicks several times in most of my nail videos, but this time I wanted to switch it up. Then I used a dotting tool for the center of the flower, and I also, I also used a lighter green for the leaves on the flowers, but you can just leave it with just that first green color if you'd like. To finish off with this design, don't forget to apply your top coat. That helps the nail polish design last so much longer then for the second design guys another I think this is a pretty easy design because you're just gonna be using a few nail polish colors start off with your base coat then paint your nails with a white nail polish then with a red nail polish we're gonna be doing the flower and again I'm using the nail brush but you can always use a toothpick and I'm gonna be drawing that flower in and there's no perfect way guys does not have to be perfect at all then you're going to do a stripe or a line for the I guess you could say the stems of the flowers and I'm going to be using a dotting tool for the center of the flowers and I also took a little bit of pink nail polish and I dabbed it on the flower as well I didn't show that part because it was a little bit blurry um, but yeah guys you cannot you can always do the same design on all the nails or you can switch it up. Don't forget to apply your top coat to finish off with this design. If you like that I share with you different nail designs in only one video, don't forget to subscribe guys to be notified of all of my future videos. Then you're going to take for this nail design, you're going to start off with your base coat. Then I applied this beautiful, I say beautiful nail polish color by simple colors I like it because it has a little bit of glitter on it then I took a green nail polish to do the leaves on my flowers then I took the nail brush and I just did some dots all the way around very easy guys you can always take your dotting tool or you can also use a toothpick for this then I also used a lighter green for that then I used a darker purple to do some more lines I guess you could say or dots on the flowers. I love this design because it looks beautiful and it has like, that glitter in the background. Don't forget to apply your top coat to finish off with this nail design. For the next nail design, again guys, start off with your base coat. Then you're going to paint your nails with a pink nail polish color. You can always use a different nail, col nail polish color if you'd like. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take your dotting tool and you can always use a bobby pin just to make it easier. I used my dotting tool because it's a little bit faster and picks up a little bit more nail polish. Then you're going to do some dots and then connect them together to make these flowers. For the center of the flowers you can always take a dotting tool and just do like a little white dot or yellow. But what I decided to do is I decided to apply these little uh, gems or diamonds, whatever you want to call them. I applied a top coat just so they could stick on and then I applied a top coat to finish off with this nail design. For the next nail design, again, start off with your base coat, then paint your nails any color of your choice. I used this turquoise color from Sally Hansen. Then I used a black nail polish to do some lines and I used my nail brush to do that. Again, take your toothpick or your dotting tool, anything that you have, any nail brush. Then what I did is I took my dotting tool and I did some white dots and I wanted to apply white nail polish before applying the pink that was gonna be the color of my flowers because I feel like the color stands out even more. So I let that dry a bit, then I moved on to do the leaves and I used my nail brush for that. And I wanted to do leaves that were different colors, so I did a light green and then I also used a darker green for that. Then once the white nail polish had dried, I went back in and use 
my pink to paint that on top. For the center of my flowers, I used a darker pink color, which kind of looks like a reddish orange color, and I just dabbed a few little dots. You can always use your dotting tool and then just do some small dots for that. Don't forget to finish off with your top coat. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. That way I can share more videos like this with you guys. Thanks for watching. I really do appreciate it. Have a great day and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.